The Queen's praises to Prince Philip, Prince Charles and Prince William in her landmark speech at the evening reception of COP26 on Monday did not go unnoticed. Princess Eugenie, one of the monarch's eight grandchildren, reacted to the mention of these leading royals in three different Instagram stories shared on her account. In her first story, Eugenie shared a post by the royal family which included a clip from the Queen's speech. The younger daughter of Sarah Ferguson and Prince Andrew added her personal comment on top of this post, writing in green, Brilliant beginning to the 20,121 United Nations Climate Change Conference. She also shared an animation of clapping hands. In her second Instagram story, Eugenie shared a video from Clarence House's Instagram account showing Prince Charles delivering his speech during yesterday's opening ceremony of the COP26 Climate Change Summit. In her third story, Princess Eugenie shared once again a post by Clarence House, this time summing up with pictures and a caption of what happened during the evening reception. Eugenie, still using a green color to honor the topic being discussed, circled a sentence in the post highlighting the part in the Queen's speech that honored Philip, Charles and William's work with the environment and its protection. Adding mentions to the Buckingham Palace, Kensington Palace and Clarence House's Instagram accounts, Eugenie showed her pride and appreciation by using a clapping emoji. Prince Charles and Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, as well as the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge are in Glasgow this week to undertake a series of engagements focused on the environment as COP26 is undergoing. Princess Eugenie has also shown a keen interest in protecting the environment and tackling some of the biggest challenges faced by planet Earth. In particular, the royal has shown an interest in protecting the oceans. Last month, she co-authored an article with the CEO of Blue Marine Foundation Claire Brook in which they hailed the ocean as the best natural solution we have to climate change on the planet.